Realtree's Midwest Whitetail is brought to you by Hoyt, Hoyman Tree Saws, Lone Wolf Tree Stands, Nikon, Ozonix, Redneck Blinds, RTP Outdoors, Spot Hog Releases, Wasp Archery, Viking Solutions, and Realtree. It's the morning of November 4th, and as you can probably tell, it's a rainy one. Uh, Brad and I got in here super early, only to have gotten poured on the entire time. And it looks like we have at least another hour of rain. But we're in a cool looking spot. It's what I would consider a, a classic rut spot back in the timber. Um, the rain helped us get deep in here this morning, so it's a cool spot. I've never been back in here before. So I don't fully know, know what to expect as far as deer movement and where they're going to come from. But just trying to catch a, a cruising buck. There's no shooters that I know of on this farm. But it's it's in a good area. And uh, just from looking at the map, it looks like there's got to be good deer coming through here during the rut. So got to be in the stand and uh, that's what we're hoping for today. It's uh, probably around 40 degrees. And uh, as soon as this rain lets up. And, uh, I would hope the deer will move. It seems like a good morning for him to, to do just that. So we'll see what happens. It's getting late in the morning here, so Brad and I are going to climb down and try to make a plan for the afternoon if we're going to go out. Uh, solid morning once it stopped raining. Uh, we're wet and cold now, though, but just had that decent four or five year old buck that 15 yards cruised by, and he and two others cruised between 9 30 and 10, so that was cool to see. Uh, wind switching a little more westerly, so we got to make a decision, um, but we're going to climb down for now and hopefully get out this afternoon. <laughs> 